Hey guys, I just wanted to make you a quick video to show you how to use the new Bluetooth uh, system I installed in the sanctuary. So, it's this Denon 200BR box here. And um, when it's on, but nothing, it's not ready to connect or connect it to anything, you'll see this very slow flashing green light. The way you can use it, it's actually a bit of a security feature to make sure not just anybody jumps on your sound system, is to hold down this pair button for three seconds. If you do that, you see it starts flashing fast. There we go. That means now it's ready to pair, so this means it'll show up in a device so the first person to grab it will get it. And hopefully then that's you. <laughs> and so then you click on, on your, look in your Bluetooth settings, it shows up as DN200BR and you hit connect. And uh, then you'll actually be able to send music through your phone um, to the sound system. It'll come up in these last two channels, 47 and 48. That replaces the 8th inch stereo cable that used to be here and that will play just like that. So you just push that in and you'd be ready to go. Um, only some small potential problem I see is that it, um, quite often phones and Bluetooth devices remember each other. So if someone turns it on, um, it might connect to your phone when they press the hold three seconds if it's like there's two or three people who've connected to it before. So be careful with that. Uh, also I thought this might be a good use for if the worship leader wanted to hear a song from Planning Center online. Um, we could always do it for them as sound people, but if they also wanted to do that themselves, they could just tell you that, and then um, you could hold down that button, and then they can uh, connect on their phone. So it actually covers the range of the whole sanctuary very clearly and strongly, so I think it's going to be a good little system. Oh yeah, thanks guys.